Thanks so much for hanging out with us. Yeah. Tell me about your journey of getting here. Everybody doesn't understand. It's not just something you sign up for and you, you write a check and yeah. you're in the Bassmaster Classic. It's a long journey. It is a long journey. And even the guy that wins this week, it's not going to be just from one week of fishing. It's going to be five, 10, maybe even 20 or 30 years of sacrifice to make that happen. So it can be a lonely road out there. So how do you manage to deal with everything going on around you when you're missing a lot of friendships, when you're missing a lot with relationships, all of that? How are you able to manage all that? The thing that I tell a lot of the high school kids we got coming up, because that continues to get bigger and bigger, is that can't just love it. Like love is not enough for this sport. Uh, you have to physically and mentally not be able to live without it. Because if you just love it, you're gonna get your teeth kicked in enough times that you'll learn not to love it. Wow. Right? It's a game of losing. Even the most winningest angler in the world has lost more than he's won. Mm. And so, I mean, you just take that into consideration. It's a losing game, and so love's just not enough. Mm. You have to be able to not live without it. Mm. And then that then allows you to be able to kind of mentally grind through those tough events through missing birthday parties, graduations, weddings, whatever it may be, mm -hmm. to know that this is where you're supposed to be.